It's a tall order, one recipe, three meals, and just 30 minutes in the kitchen. And Phil Vickery says he can do it. In, well, when that a very you've got big about, side, about seven. Seven minutes. <laughs> <laughs> and all, all for under about four quid, so it wow. works really well. Here it is. So um, that's the base dish there, potatoes, tomatoes, bit of coriander. Then at the back we've got a pie, Ooh. as you can see, which we add a few more ingredients to. And on the right-hand side we've got a bit like a bullet and squeak type idea with a poached egg. Don't worry, Philip, I'm going to put the egg on the side so Yummy. you hate it. But it comes great. with a, a spicy pepper dew mayonnaise. So the thing about vegetarian food, I love vegetarian food. The older I get, the more I eat it. I just find it really satisfying. And mm. I think it just fills me up and it's delicious and it's great value for money. So let's, get, let's talk about the base. In here I've got onions. Yeah. Which I just cooked down like that. Then I'm going to add a turmeric, cumin and chilli. In that goes. All full of goodness. Yeah. Lovely for you. Then, potatoes that I've cooked previously. Now, you can buy um, roasted potatoes out the freezer. You know, the ones cook them, it's up to yeah. you. I'm just using boiled potatoes, which we just cut into four bits. OK. Any cooked potato will do. In that goes. Then I add uh, about... Well, we put about 100 grams of spinach, 150 grams of spinach. Looks like a lot, but that cooks down to roughly an eighth of what the bag size is. Oh, OK. So it's a really good idea to, to, to talk about that. Then, once that's cooked down, give it a couple of minutes, you'll see it'll start to steam down. Then add two or three chopped tomatoes, this fresh is tomatoes. It's definitely five day, isn't it, Oh, this goodness, meal? yeah, yeah. And looking at that doesn't look particularly appetising. It does. But, well... My daughter wouldn't say that. Oh, really? <laughs> no. No. no, no. Lid on and just cook it for around about 10 to 15 minutes and you'll end up with this one here. Mm -hmm. So that is how you can see where the spinach is broken down. Delicious. So what I wanted was a, almost like a dry sort of like Bombay potato type curry yeah. idea, but not too much liquid at this stage. So what I'm going to do is just serve this onto here. Now this is the, the original that we did. Plenty of salt. So that's meal number one. That's meal number one. Now, a lot of salt and pepper, obviously, to get it going. But here I've got a bit of yoghurt. A bit of sorry, sorry. A bit of bit of chopped lettuce and some mint and a flatbread. So it becomes a dip type spooning up. Oh you yummy! Like. Have a little taste Are you of that. Anything with that yogurt? A bit of honey. Oh honey! Just a right, okay. Have a little taste. See what you think. Yeah, I will. Now that one um, again is okay. just very very simple and oh, it's like all vegetarian food, I suppose. Are you diving in? You let. I will. Yes, I'll let you make your. Um, you you just let the flavours work for themselves. Okay. Let's move that out of the way. Okay. So that's the base. Now, this will... Is there a little fork up there? Is one up your end up there? Oh, sorry. Is that where it's there? Who put that there? <laughs> By me, I had no idea. <laughs> it's a cutlery drawer. <laughs> <laughs> Right, just one thing clever say, girl. <laughs> um, <laughs> I do add paprika, but you only add paprika once the <laughs> a vegetables have been sauteed. Never add it to oil. Not listen to me, because it burns. But there we are. OK. Use a fork, use a fork. <laughs> I don't worry about that. So that's the base. I'm not going to touch those forks. <laughs> <laughs> Mm. Now that'll keep three days in the fridge, or you can Yummy. make a big batch and then pop it in the freezer in lumps and take it out as you want. That's it. delicious. Just simple, mm -hmm. really tasty grub, like mm. a nice lunchtime. Idea. Nice. Really delicious. 